The Oscars are only two days away, but it's not too late to catch up on this year's nominated films. Here to tell us all about the films and where to see them before the big night is entertainment reporter Sandy Kenyon. Hey, Sandy. Hi, Kenyon. Hey, hi. Welcome. Wow. Thanks it's for a good year this year. Yeah, it's, it's a, a great, great year. year for movies, and there's a couple of big blockbusters. Remember those years at the Oscars where the big picture was uh, one of those smaller movies? Sure. Always. Very worthy. Mm -hmm. This time, big blockbusters in the running. We're going to tell you about that. Okay. And it's rare to have a couple of blockbusters. But here's the really cool thing, as Mark said. There are so many ways to see these movies still. Yeah. Back in the old days when I started, if you missed them in theaters, how do you catch that up? That was right. it. Yeah. But the fact is... Now you can catch up. We're going to tell you how. Okay. So take us through first uh, American Fiction. American Fiction is, uh, I married into the publishing business many years ago. My wife is a best-selling novelist, mm -hmm. Eileen Gouge. And uh, so I know a little bit about it. This is a wonderful satire of mm -hmm. what makes publishing so interesting, mm -hmm. but much broader than that, of course. It's about the whole notion of political correctness. It's about a writer who is frustrated, so he decides to write a different kind of book. Jeffrey Wright is nominated, Sterling K. Brown playing his brother, Tracy Ellis Ross mm. as his sister. It's excellent if you I haven't love that seen movie. it. Yeah. You can uh, rent or buy it on most services, and it is in theater still, great. as yeah, most of film. these are. Yeah, we, yeah. we saw it. Um, next is Anatomy of a Fall. Anatomy of Fall is Loved great. It. This is a, You love this yeah. movie. This is about a crime. Did she do it or did he commit suicide? You never know. The mm -hmm. husband dies. It's a troubled relationship. This is available to rent or buy on most services. And it'll start streaming on Hulu March 22nd. So 22nd of this month for oh, Hulu wow. subscribers. The sound in that film was yeah. absolutely Perfect. One of the yeah, the kid that played the son, I was surprised he didn't, didn't get, get a nominated. A nomination. Yeah, he was amazing. yeah, a child actor, you hesitate to use that term about that performance sure. because he's so good. Yeah. I agree. Right. Oh, take us through Barbie. Uh, now, uh, if there if there are three people left in the world who haven't seen it, where can they see well, it? Well, I do. You can see it. It's streaming on Max. Mm -hmm. It's available on most services. But I'm going to use the time on Barbie yeah. to make a plea to see it in theaters as I did. And then you can witness while you're watching the movie the very interesting conversations between couples. Yes. Now, a couple of couples broke up after seeing the movie. Well, having seen it with them, yes. I can... See why that is. That's it's fascinating. Funny. <laughs> uh, the holdovers. Holdovers, Paul Giamatti. If there is one person who's going to sneak in there mm. for best actor, it's Paul Giamatti, a beloved figure, the performance of a lifetime, as a master at a New England boarding school forced to spend the Christmas holidays <laughs> with a group of... Uh, Misfit Students. Yes, by the incredible Alexander Payne, who's just an amazing yeah. director. And Davine Joy Randolph has yeah. won just about yes. everything. She's, as she's a fabulous. kitchen worker yeah. who's with them, mm -hmm. and she's terrific. See that in uh, various places, most services, but yeah. also it's streaming on Peacock. Oh, okay. great. Okay, what about Killers of a Flower Moon? Mark just saw just, that on the plane. On the plane, yeah. It was a long, it was a long flight. Yes, yeah. a long movie, <laughs> long flight. Yes, I love it. And, uh, of course, Lily Gladstone, the favorite amazing. to win for Best Actress. This is also also in theaters, it's streaming on Apple TV Plus, and it's purchase on other services. Mm. But you can still see it. It is important in so many ways. Uh, Lily is the first Native American actress ever to be nominated in the lead she's category, fabulous. and she's she, fantastic. Yes, she really is. Yeah. All right, we have to take a commercial break, but we have more with Sandy Canyon. Where to watch this year's Oscar-nominated film when we return? We're back with Sandy Kenyon, and we're talking about the films nominated for Best Picture and where to see them before this weekend's Oscars. All right, what's next? And you can see most of them. That's the cool mm -hmm. thing. And Maestro is next. Oh. This is Bradley uh, yeah. Cooper, and uh, yeah. this is really popular. It's in theaters. It's on Netflix, and uh, you can watch it. This is one that does, again, benefit from the big screen. I have to say, mm -hmm. when he finally conducts mm -hmm. years for six minutes, as he said, he sells it. And the sound probably <laughs> right. the theater right. is going to be great. Yeah, of so. course. And Carrie Mulligan also oh, is fabulous. Fantastic. Yeah. And a very complex part. Oh, for sure. Uh, tell us about Oppenheimer. Oppenheimer, I really want you to see it on the big screen. Mm -hmm. I mm -hmm. saw this in IMAX, and I saw it a second time on a smaller screen. There is nothing like seeing Killian Murphy four stories high. Just say it. Wow. It's not so much the explosion itself, 
But this is the one to see in theaters. Now, keep in mind, these movies go away right after Oscars. Mm -hmm. So if okay. you're going to take my recommendation, let's see it in theaters very soon. It's also streaming on Peacock, and you can rent or buy on most services. But that would be my bit. If you see one in theaters, make it that one. All right, mm -hmm. one of my favorites, Past Lives. I love this movie. I love it, too. Sobbed. We sobbed. We cried. really loved it. Yeah. The director told me that she was sitting with her first love from Korea with her current husband in Brooklyn, and she suddenly thought, this is a movie. Wow. Now, when you go see Past Lives, you see the moment of conception. It's incredible. <laughs> and where can we watch that? It's on most services and streaming, too, on Paramount Plus mm -hmm. and on Showtime. And that's the one where I'm really going to recommend take, my fa take, take it on faith and go see it. And yeah. bring some tissues. Yes. Yes. Absolutely. What about Poor Things? Poor Things was my number one most favorite of yeah. last yeah. year. Yes, yeah. it was. Emma Stone Amazing. in a career-defining performance. She's incredible. She <laughs> really it, is. It, it's, I told her at the premiere, you know, this film is bonkers. And she yeah. says, yeah, but it's good bonkers. Yeah. <laughs> she didn't it disagree. It's good bonkers. It, visually stunning. It's only in theaters. Go see it while you can. And Mark yeah. Ruffalo. Yes, I thought absolutely. Was just... Mark Ruffalo is maybe it's maybe my favorite performance of, of the, all yeah. time. And can we just say, just briefly, the sexiest movie yes. in terms yes, of sure. content? Sure. So sure. be more on yeah, that. Yeah. Okay, and lastly, Zone of Interest. Well, I knew I was coming on the show, so this was actually the last movie that I hadn't seen. Saw it over the weekend. Yeah, we okay. saw it. And it is a movie. I think you'll agree that you invest the time in, and it gets great rewards. There have been many movies made about the Holocaust. This is unusual in that it focuses in on the commandant of Auschwitz and his family living normal, living bountiful your, lives, living best lives with a garden yeah. and so forth. Yes. And it focuses on them, and it ends with a power. I will not give it away, yes. but it ends towards the end is the present day. And that contrast between what we've seen, it's leisurely, give it some time, give it your heart and soul. Yeah, I am, am I wrong here? No, 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 interesting, no. interesting yeah. camera angles that you never see in a film, no, not your conventional way right. that you would see a no, film. No, I keep telling everyone, I'm, uh, I'm like, it is a departure from the typical Holocaust film. Completely, yeah. And it is. It's powerful. And it's somehow even worse. I yeah. mean, that's the thing. It, yes. I mean, it's beautiful. It's, it's a beautiful, and horrible, incredible and horrible. And you don't film, see that. Yep. But right. it is, the story is horrible and devastating. And we should tell you that it is available on most services, mm -hmm. but you must buy it at this point. Okay. Yeah. And I'm recommending you do that. Yeah. It's also in theaters. Sandy, yeah, yeah. thank you so much. This was great. Great, great Thanks. Thanks. <laughs> Check out Sandy on Disney's syndicated show on the red carpet. Looking forward to your awesome coverage as well. Yes. yes thank you. All right, we'll be right back.